Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 7 tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about helpers. Helpers in Laravel are built-in utility functions that we can call from anywhere uh, within our application. If they hadn't been provided by the core framework, you might have ended up developing our own helpers. So now let's see how we can create our own helpers in Laravel 7. So switch to the project and just go uh, inside the app directory and here just create a new folder. Let's say folder name is helpers. Okay. And inside this helpers folder just create a new file uh, functions.php. Okay. Now just create a function here. So I'm just going to create a function. Uh, just splitting the name so just write here php function and function name let's say function name is a split name okay pass the parameter name okay now just write here dollar name is equal to dream dollar name okay dollar name array explode let's split with the space so just write here a space and pass here the dollar name okay now first name dollar name array and just pass the first zero index and last name pass here the name array one index okay and simply uh, return here array dollar first name comma dollar last name okay this is the function for a splitting name now save the file and uh, configure this helper to the auto load. So just open composer.json file. So just open this and here inside the auto load, just add here files colon create an array and inside this just write here the path of this function.php file okay so just write here app slash folder name which is helpers and file name function functions.php okay now save the file and just do the command prompt and here just to stop the running application and Execute the command composer a space dump dash auto load. Okay, now press enter. Okay, it's generating optimized auto load files. It's processing. All right, it's done. Now let's use this helper. So just create a controller for testing this helper method. So just I'm going to create a test controller. So just write here PHP artisan make colon controller as this test controller. Okay, now press enter. Okay, controller created. Now run the application so just write here php artisan server press enter now switch to the project and just open test controller so just go inside the app directory then http controllers and here is test controller okay inside the test controller just create a function 
to use this function so just here public function function let's say function name is get first and last name okay and here simply return and just call this function helper function so just copy and here paste okay now pass here the uh, pass here the name here so i'm just going to pass here the name zach miller okay now save the file and just create a route for this so go to the web.php file so just open route web.php and here just add the route uh, get and let's say uh, uri which is get first last name okay now add the controller name which is test controller at date function name and function name is this so just copy and paste here all right now all done so let's check so this to the browser and just copy this URI and switch to the browser and here just add here get first last name and press enter and you can see here the first name and last name okay so in this way you can create and use custom helpers in Laravel 7 so that's all about uh, helpers in Laravel 7 so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question, you can ask me in the comment box. Don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.